London, a group that represents UK. Hospitals and Ambulance Services has warned that its members may run out of drugs if Britain leaves the European Union without an agreement on future relations. In a letter published Tuesday, NHS providers said a lack of visible and appropriate communication from the government is hampering preparations for a so-called no-deal Brexit. Britain Brexit Secretary Dominic Robb is in Brussels Tuesday to meet Chief EU negotiator Michel Barnier for a new round of talks. John Tice, AFP, Getty Images, in a letter to National Health Service bosses that was leaked to the Times of London, the group's chief executive said it would be more efficient to develop contingency plans nationally rather than have to reinvent the wheel 229 times. Chris Hobson said the entire supply chain of pharmaceuticals could be affected by the failure to reach a deal, adding that it could also jeopardize the EU work force on which the NHS relies, Britain is due to leave the EU on March 29th, and aims to hammer out an agreement with the bloc on divorce terms and the outlines of future trade in the next few months so that it can be approved by individual EU countries before Brexit Day. Article continued below but talks have got bogged down amid infighting within British Prime Minister Theresa May's divided Conservative government, and fears of a no-deal Brexit are growing. Last week Latvian Foreign Minister Edgars Rinkovics put the chances of getting a Brexit deal at 50 to 50. British businesses have warned that leaving without a deal could cause mayhem for trade and travel, bringing higher food prices, log jams around UK ports and disruption to everything from aviation to medical supplies. The UK government says it remains confident of reaching a deal, but is preparing for all outcomes. Foreign Secretary Jeremy Hunt said Tuesday that the chance of no deal was not negligible, and that outcome would be bad both for Britain and for the EU. Read more. Two years after Brexit vote, UK Still divided opinion, why Britain is pondering an exit from Brexit Britain Brexit Secretary Dominic Robb is in Brussels Tuesday to meet Chief EU negotiator Michel Barnier for a new round of talks. On Thursday, the UK government plans to publish the first in a series of technical reports outlining the effects a no-deal Brexit would have on various sectors and offering advice to businesses and the public on how to prepare.